This is Ina Fried again with CNET. I'm back with Babur Habib and Osman, the other co-founder of No, and we wanted to get a little bit closer look at the interface, so we have a different prototype unit um, sure. where we can see what the interface and experience looks like beyond just opening a single textbook. So, exactly. Barbara, why don't you show me what you have? Uh, so here we have the desktop. This is when the device opens. This is what the student sees. This is what we call the semester view. Uh, this is fall 2010. The student is taking. Uh, the student is taking four or five classes. You have your textbook, your notebook, links to your uh, websites that you may. Uh, may consider it important for that particular uh, class. Uh, so this is what we call the, uh, uh, the, the semester view. Then we also have what we call my library. And students are able to figure out exactly how they want to uh, uh, sort out their content on this device. Uh, you can look at all the content, you can look at, you can look at books, oh, notebooks, uh, docs, media. On the left hand side what you have is what we call the chalkboard and instead of just uh, dealing with their academic uh, uh, world this is where they figure out okay what are they going to do in the next two hours how they're going to uh, prepare for the play, play rehearsal that they have to go to what are they doing in the evening and on top is the app store. We are firm believers that all the content is not going to come from a single source. It's going to come from multiple sources, including publishers, uh, educators, professors, and we feel even students are going to uh, be contrib uh, contributing as developers on our platform. Plus the web, obviously. One of the big features is full Linux, full web browser. So, so it's, it's a browser-based uh, operating system on top of embedded Linux. Uh, we're building on uh, uh, NVIDIA's Tegra T20, uh, which is a high-performance, low-power platform. Uh, we do support Flash because a lot of the educational content is in Flash. Um, and uh, it's a browser-based OS, so full internet capability. Great. Well, thanks for giving us a good look at it. Thank you.